Good afternoon, guys, from the Kentucky Horse Park, where they are preparing for a very big weekend, and they have a special invite for you to come be a part of the Thoroughbred Makeover. It is a special project through the Retired Racehorse Project. Jen Reutz, what is this weekend all about? So the weekend is all about celebrating what these thoroughbreds do after racing. Keeneland's running starting this week for the month of October, and after racing, these horses go on, and they have really cool careers in the show ring or in lesson barns or just as people's recreational horses and this is how it starts what do they do after they're done with their racing career what do you guys do with the horses so the average racehorse retires at age five but their usability extends until well into their 20s and yeah. they usually live to between 25 and 30 if not older so after racing they can be trained to do pretty much anything you would do with a horse so here at the retired racehorse project thoroughbred makeover all of these horses are in their first year after racing and they're being retrained to do something else. The ones behind us right now have been retrained to do jumping. They're either competing in show hunters or show jumpers. Um, and it's just, I mean, it's a good foundation to give these horses that serves them through the rest of their lives. A, a well-trained horse is a protected horse. And so it's a great thing to do for these horses, for the industry and the riders love them. And they're competing this weekend as well. Yeah, they're competing for over $135,000 in prize money. So we have horses coming in from all over the country. They get different prize money for winning each division that they're entered in. They get prize money if they are the horse that made the most starts or the horse that sold for the most money or the horse that was bred in a certain state and places the highest of all horses from that state. So there's a lot of incentives for the riders. And then these riders have spent the last 10 months training these horses and they've invested almost $10,000 on average turning them from a racehorse into a show horse. So it's it's a really cool process to watch and we're just thrilled to be a part of it. And oh yeah, if you come out and you see a horse you like, you can even maybe leave with it? Yes! What? Yes, so I'd say about 150 of the horses competing this weekend are for sale. So if an equestrian is looking for their next show horse or their next just recreational riding horse, trail horse, or just an all around family horse. There's all different kinds of horses here. There's that slow buddy that loves to eat treats and wants to be part of their family. There's some that are fantastic upper level prospects and you could well see one of these guys in the Olympics at some point. So we've got everything here and there's no other place in the world that you could see 150 prospects that you could choose from and look at and get to know. Very cool thing yeah. that you guys are doing this weekend. Well, you can come be a part of it. Things are kicking off tomorrow and running through Saturday for the thoroughbred makeover. I'm Deanne Stevens out and about at the Kentucky Horse Park. Back to you.